Hi, I'm Forrest with Seam. Today I'll be demoing our Smart Lock API that lets you control devices from brands like Schlage, Igloo Home, Quickset, TT Lock, Yale, and more. This API standardizes core device functions across brands such as programming access codes, unlocking doors, and receiving events based on door operations. Integrating Seam's Smart Lock API saves your team from building dozens of separate brand integrations and makes your product instantly compatible with thousands of different smart lock models. For this demo, we'll be controlling this Igloo Home lock. We'll start by connecting the device to our Seam workspace. Next, we'll issue API calls to retrieve the device, trigger an unlock, and program a time-bound access code. All right, so first I'll go to the Seam console and connect this device. I'll click here to add the device then click Igloo Home. I'll enter my credentials. Now I'll wait for the authorization. All right, and now our device is connected to Seam. Now normally this connection flow is performed directly inside your product using our embedded connect flow, letting your users connect their devices directly inside your app. So now I'll pull up a small interactive code sample and we'll make a few API calls. To start, let's just retrieve the smart lock through the Seam API and inspect it. First, we'll import Seam and initialize it using our API key. Next, we'll use the device ID to retrieve this device and log it to see its content. Okay, let's run this. Cool, so here's our device. Here you can see some basic information about the device. For example, we can see the manufacturer, Igloo Home, its serial number, whether it's currently locked and online, its battery level, supported code length, and a couple of capability flags that tell us what you can do with the lock. Okay, next we'll issue an unlock command via the Seam API. First, we'll confirm that the device can remotely unlock by checking the capability flag and then issue this command. Okay, let's run this. Now let's check the door. Great, it unlocked. Next, we're going to program access codes. With the Seam API, you can program two different types of access codes on smart locks, permanent access codes and time-bound access codes. As the name implies, permanent access codes will be on the device from the moment you issue that create command through the Seam API and until you request their removal. Time-bound access codes are different. They are only active on the device based on the start time and end time you provide to Seam. You can issue a create command with a start time far out into the future, and Seam will ensure that the code is active only when you've specified it. Let's create one to show you. All right, so first we check that the device supports programming a code. Next, we set the starts at one minute from now. Lastly, we set the ends at timestamp for two minutes from now. All right, let's run this. Seam will now ensure that the access code only becomes active at the start time. Let's wait one minute and try this code. All right, let's try it out. Great, it worked. And if you configured webhooks, you'll receive an unlock event indicating which access code was used. Awesome. In summary, Seam's API lets you connect and control smart locks from different brands to create access codes, unlock doors, and receive events, all using a single API. To get started, you can either sign up on our website or contact our implementation and sales team for a quick demo. We can't wait to see what you build. See you next time.